Uh, that kid, Stan, getting a chance to take the day off. Stanley, you, we'll go first with you. You get a chance to watch. I know you're ultra competitive. Uh, you progressed a ton this spring in this offense, man. Uh, how are you feeling things are going with you? Uh, it's going pretty good. You know, feel myself progressing and uh, growing and just, you know, getting faster and learning the game more mentally. Yeah, you've matured so much. I'd watch you on the sidelines. You kind of yuck it up. You have a lot of guys you mess with. You've been all business here about the last six, eight weeks. Uh, what, what's been the difference? Just the young guys, you know, just being a leader every day. You know, the young guys have to follow somebody every day. So they got to come out there and be ready every day. All right. Now, I've learned long enough not to ask you how you're feeling. I'm going to assume you feel good. Uh, back to being your normal, explosive, easygoing self. You look like a polished wide receiver. Were you on a mission? Uh, absolutely. Uh, determined, you would say. Um, you know, Coach Dub had uh, many conversations with me to you know just things I needed to get better. And uh, I wasn't comfortable really with my knee last year. And uh, I'm a lot more comfortable and I feel better. And I mean, I'm running bras better, so I'm there. All right, so you guys say, before we let you go, there's something interesting because it ha leadership has to fit your personality. Both you guys, very easygoing, good natured. How do you turn it on with so many young guys that you have to bring along? Do they? Is it better that they understand you or that you understand them as the leaders of this receiving court? Um, it's kind of, you know, lead by example, but being open to where they can come and talk to you and feel comfortable um, to where they're not too afraid or uh, to where they won't be. They, they, they can come to you and ask anything, you know. It's just it's being open and being here that we're all teammates and everything like that. You know, so I mean, that's that's what we we try we try to do, you know. And uh, me and Stan, you know, we kind of go off each other. And uh, if, if I'm down, he picks me up. If if he down, I pick him up. So you know, we just, we feed off each other, you know. But guys, you saw Mikael Wilbon peek his head in there. Considering this is the circus, you know he'll clown. Back to you guys in the booth.